is the first first round series that LeBron James has lost in his career. We could uh, never fully get into a rhythm. Disappointing ending for the Golden State Warriors. How are you digesting the way the season ended? Um, I have no idea. Is there a changing of the guard? All right, so my point is this. The young guys, they're balling. We got to give them props. Key part of this youth movement in the playoffs, mm -hmm. seven players at age 25 or younger are averaging at least 25 points this postseason. The game will be in, it's always going to be in great hands for guys like that. Exter was the first ever company to send me their product, and I gotta say, man, this is amazing. Exter is a beautiful, modern looking wallet that makes your life easier. The Exter wallet is simple and unique, holds and protects your essentials, and you kind of look like a businessman. This is the Parliament wallet that comes in all sorts of different colors. When you open it up, it contains slides to hold extra cards, a clip to hold your dollars, and the most important part, the coolest part, is there is a built in aluminum card holder that lifts all your cards with the touch of a button. It also comes with a tracker that you can connect to your phone in case you lose it anywhere in the world. Get your wallets now by using the link in my description to get a 20% discount on all their amazing product. Listen, clear out your big dusty wallets and simplify your pockets game, okay? Enjoy. Suns have gone on the road after missing the playoffs for 11 consecutive years and beaten the defending champion on their home court in the first round. It is the first first round series that LeBron James has lost in his career. The Memphis Grizzlies are in the playoffs. They eliminate the Golden State Warriors. Disappointing ending for the Golden State Warriors. How are you digesting the way the season ended? Um... <clears throat> I have no idea. Well, Ryan, I know a lot of times we ask you about the things you accomplished in your career. You say when it's all over, you'll go back and look at it uh, with Maverick and some wine. But this is the first time you didn't make it out of the first round, and it also ends the final streak for you. Uh, can you look back at, at that run at all and put it in the context in terms of everything that you sacrificed and everything you did to be able, be able to do that over this last decade and a half? selection in the entire history of the NBA most valuable player Steph Curry you expect greatness and that's the part like I, I've enjoyed so much about playing in finals against him you know having a rival that, that we have with Golden State being able to see LeBron and Steph go with each other in the finals. You ever just kind of sit back and realize like, man, we're watching two of the greatest players in the history of the game go at each other. Sensation Trey Young tied a rookie high this season with 36 points, going 8 of 12 from three. Is Trey the new Steph? He's unbelievable. Uh, just the confidence that he plays with. Uh, I call it the flair, but he's just, he just always seems like he's always composed and knows what he's trying to do every time he has the ball in his hand. I would tell you that last night watching him shoot the basketball, the brother's got range. This is what he does and you're asking the question about who's the closest thing on the come up to what Steph Curry was when he came into the league and what he ultimately evolved into. I think Trey Young is in that discussion and he's worthy of it. And there's the dribble. Great to shoot.
Donovan Mitchell? But I could have guessed she was going to ask me that question. You knew it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. But what, what can you say about what are, about his fourth quarter, the way he takes control for just being a rookie? I mean, very few rookies do that. I think uh, this league is all about opportunity and confidence. And he's been given both, obviously, the talent. That's what this league is about. It's talent all over the place from top to bottom. I like him. He's a very good player. But nobody expected, as a 13 pick, Donovan Mitchell to lead his team in scoring. They're on a win streak that's phenomenal. He's making big plays in crunch time. And also, he has now become the Jazz best player. Oh, my. oh you have to love it. Clarkson to Mitchell. A thing of beauty. He goes up with shot, hits it. Mitchell. Punches it home and sends it with his chest. And last hug it. Mitchell! Nasty! Luca is one of my favorite players in the NBA today. From the simple fact of the way I play the game is exactly how I love the way he plays the game. Team first, gets his guys involved. If you challenge me to score, I'm gonna score. And at the same time, I'm gonna score and also at the same time, I'm gonna keep my guys involved. But I only, I play for the team and I'm gonna play with a sense of joy. Doncic. When you look around the playoffs and see some of the young players just having outstanding postseasons so far. We know who's going to inherit the league, and we're watching them we're right now. A key part of this youth movement in the playoffs, mm. seven players at age 25 or younger are averaging at least 25 points this postseason. Is there a changing of the guard? The young guys, they're balling. We got to give them props. Uh, there's some young guns in this game, Book. You know, Donovan Mitchell, Luca, John Morant, and I was just to name a few. Uh, Jason Tatum, and let me not forget about him, how special he is. Um, but, you know, those guys are great, and the game will be in, is always going to be in great hands with guys like that. Um, there's a lot of villains that go through Madison Square Garden. Do you embrace that role? Do you like that? A sea of moves for public enemy number one, Trey Young. Here is Young, finds his spot. Young on the floater, puts it in with a miraculous shot. I mean, it got real quiet at the end, and uh, for me, uh, I wanted to hear those FU chants again. Luca's the truth. Luca's the truth. Luca's the best. Uh, like, I'm gonna say it on national television. Luca's the best white boy I've seen since Larry Bird. This brother is something special. The Dallas Mavericks have come into Staples Center and lead two games to none. Morant will try to drive, and he does with a scoop wow. and a score. Memphis has pulled the upset. I'm not afraid of nobody. He just dropped 47 points. They go into Morant. Oh, my goodness. Donovan Mitchell is a superstar. That's the best player in the history of the Jazz organization right there. Jason Tatum on fire. Tatum crossover, pull up jumper. It's good. 50 points for Jason Tatum. Oh, Jokic hits it. Oh, my goodness. Jokic. Booker three, another one. Oh, Booker cannot miss. Devin Booker reminds me a lot of a little Kobe. Mitchell, fake. Got a three. Wow. As one fires from the way, Dallas Cowboy takes it out. When the appropriate, you are in the garden. You might as well take a bow. <laughs> Afternoon, history was made as Nikola Jokic was officially named the most valuable player in the NBA. 